Lesson plan two is about drawing the line. There's gonna, you're about to do a million drills of drawing the line. Each one is as important as the other one. It's just circumstantial. It's like which position you're in, which one would I apply. So first one, over under, right? Now, I get a two on one, and I'm trying to break his grip. But even if I don't break his grip, I'm creating space. My elbow is attached to my body. Try to bring your arm down, me. It, it's blocking. And I've got his hands. I'm going to bend my knees underneath. I'm going to move my head to the outside. I'm going to keep control with the outside arm. I'm going to step with this inside hand and that leg at the same time as I come behind my opponent. So, you know, drill one here and here. I'm going to elevate. I'm trying to elevate, but I'm really making sure that it doesn't come down. Change levels. Do the jerk move where you try to armbar your friend. Keep control with the hand. Take this arm and this leg out to the back. Same concept of that drill. He jumps up on my back. I'm going to come. I'm going to get a two on one. Fight into the head. Now I'm going to hula hoop. Standing up. Same move. Just standing. We're right here and here. Offensively, you want to be tight. Defensively, you want to make space. I'm going to go to my free arm side, controlling the arm. I'm going to start to scoot out to make space. Then I'm going to go to my shoulder. That's my free arm. At the same time this elbow goes down, this leg is going to pivot. Now from here, I take my free arm, I draw the line, and then I go to the seat. Look this way on your knees. Here and here, make the space, make the space, collapse to the shoulder, bring the knee at the same time, draw the line with the arm, go to your seat. Our partner has hooks, now I'm going to do the same concept, I'm going to go two on one, I'm going to seat clamp under his leg, bring your arm down. Because my elbow is on his knee, he can't bring his arm down. And I'm going to scoot my body down. Then I'm going to put his arm on the other side of my head. I'm going to bring my body up and in on the same side as the arm. And I'm going to put my back flat on the mat. As I do that, I take my free inside arm and I put my elbow down on the mat, pushing away with my elbow on my opponent, keeping this leg posted, cutting this leg underneath as I raise my hand to shift the weight coming into position. So again, two hooks. So one, block, knee, down, drive the body, get the elbow down, Close on the foot, cut the leg, raise the hand. Back in. Now we're here, I feel that he's loose, he's not hooked to my foot. Take the free arm, come back, grab the hip, throw him down, bring the arm through. Now, if he's tight, it'll be very difficult. Come back, sir. If I grab it, and go down, I won't be able to get my arm out. I'm here. See on top, sir? He's up. I grab him. I throw it down. I bring the arm here and here. Sir? So now he's behind me. He's going to pick a side. I'm going to sit and turn to the side that he's on because, once again, I want to make space. So it's here. Uh, yeah, no, 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 just on your knees. Go over under. So now he's on this side, so I'm going to go that way. Knee comes up. Sit. Collapse to my shoulder. On this side, this knee follows. 
my arm comes up to the single, draw the line. Simple. Once again, here and here, knee comes up, boom, collapse to the shoulder, draw the line, go to the single. So drawing the line is really important. Sometimes they snap you down and you take a shot and he's got you in a front head body. So now his weight's on me. He's going to go spin behind. I'm going to draw the line. And I'm going to go to my single. So go ahead. you can sometimes have them put their hands behind their back. Put your, hand, put your hands behind your back. So circle this way. I'm going to draw the line. Now he'll put his hands back on me. And I'll go to my single. Draw the line. Go to the single. Simple drill. Another drill that we do with John Wine is when a person is on top position and he's doing a double wrist ride, he'll put his forehead in the back of my head. So grab uh, underneath. I would like you to go to your boots, sir. So what I want you to do to me right now is come in here, double wrist ride, and drive down. So another form of drawing the line, here and here, my opponent has a double wrist right and he's driving in. Now, I don't want to free this hand because he'll first, because he can put, he can drill this hand behind my back. So if I had a choice, I'm going to pick the inside. We're here again. I drive forward and roll my arm out, elbow in. Now. I'm going to bring my butt, I'm going to bring my butt up in the air as I scoop away. I'm going to bring this hand in and draw the line as I circle out and back step. Coming out the back door, controlling my partner's wrist. Keeping it tight with my body, using this leg and this hand to come to his hip and pulling the arm out. And go to a C clamp. It's not really my concern. I put my hook in, tap choke. Really, the arm is his problem. But just simply from drawing the line. Once again, it will look like this. Come on this side, sir. No, no, see, I'm listening. So now we've turned the angle. He's here, he's driving me in. I'm going to rotate forward, swim my arm out, fight my elbow in, keep this hand trapped. Grab my wrist, sir. Now I'm going to bring my butt in the air and turn out as I bring this arm through and start to circle my head out, back stepping, keeping the hand behind the back. I can at this point, too, go to a double C, C clamp, keep my weight on, and drive it up. Final one from the series is going to be, sir, standing up, partner goes to pick you up, hook the leg, move the hands to the hips, explode, boom, off, hand in the back pocket, opposite side of the head, for the shot. So, partner goes to pick me up, I hook the leg, as I come down, my hands adjust my hips to his position, shoot my hips down and up, hands thrust out, his head's on that side, hand in the back pocket. That's all lesson planned.